Hello, welcome back to Joe's Home Flavors. So today we're going to be cooking clams and we're going to be uh, doing it the Portuguese uh, style. If you ever visit the Algarve before, you probably have uh, tried this, uh, this way of cooking clams. So we're going to be using a little bit of uh, uh, white wine, dry white wine, um, some garlic, a little bit of lemon juice, uh, butter, salt and pepper, and uh, the clams themselves, and uh, that's pretty much it. So let's get on with, uh, with our process then. So first thing we're going to be doing is to get a little bit of this butter um, on a pan. Okay. And then we don't need it to have to be too high uh, on the heat. Then we need to use some uh, garlics. The, the, the garlic cloves, I'm using about six of them, but uh, um, it's, it's up to taste obviously. But we don't, use, we don't need to uh, be worried about the skin because we're not gonna use it, uh, we're not gonna eat the, the garlic. Okay, so garlic's in. This is really quick, but really delicious. Okay, here we are. Let's render with that butter. And we have a couple of bay leaves as well. And our clams should go in right now. These are Vietnamese uh, clams. I'm working with the, the frozen um, variety uh, because I couldn't find um, uh, the time to go to the, to the market and uh, given the circumstances probably wasn't a very good idea. So uh, frozen clams, but they are every bit as delicious as, as, the, as the fresh ones. So I've uh, uh, thawed them before uh, in, the, in cold water and then obviously get rid of the water and then we use it for our cooking. So this is going now. Now we can uh, cram up the, the heat. And let it uh, get it a little bit of temperature on those clams, just on the butter. In the meantime, um, I'm going to use some of that parsley, um, stock and all, just to just to give it a little a little color. Just roughly chopped. Okay. Clams are going nice. Now we add a little bit of uh, dry white wine. Okay. Cover it again so they don't lose too much temperature. I haven't seasoned it yet. So you can use um, fresh lemon juice or you can use um, from um, one of these things which is lemon juice as well. So I'm going to use just a little bit just to give it a nice tang. This would be a good time for you to go and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Um, share with your friends if you like um, the video and if you like obviously the, the recipe. This is really really easy and uh, anyone can do this at, uh, at their home. You don't even need to do it al fresco as I'm doing it today. You can uh, just do it in the kitchen and uh, yeah it's really easy. It's a crowd pleaser and uh, it's a, a magnificent uh, starter for a, a nice uh, summer meal. Okay. Yeah they're going great now. I'm going to season it now with the salt. And some pepper. Let it cook for another, another few minutes. All in all, uh, the clams should cook for about 10-15 minutes. But you, you know when your clams are, um, are cooked. 
they should all uh, open the shell if they haven't already if uh, you find any any clam that the shell is not open don't eat it just bin it probably means it was dead when it was caught oh this is nice you get a sawn at the same time you need to make sure that the clams had no water in them whatsoever because otherwise you'll have to get rid of that water before you can actually make your sauce so if you haven't uh, got the chance to, to check on my other uh, recipe as well I'll put a, a link up here because um, this is a two-part meal so this is um, the entree so, so this is the starter and then the main meal the main meal is uh, some uh, some pasta um, that I made uh, which like I said I'll put the link up here so you can uh, you can um, go and check that one out it's a, very, it's a classic carbonara um, with the fresh pasta homemade pasta so um, also you on that one you can see how, how um, home fa um, made pasta is, is done and how easy it is and uh, the carbonara is um, it's a, a very popular go-to uh, meal because it's it's so easy to to make so yeah by all means so yeah so this is going to be our starter and the carbonara is going to be um, our main course today okay so our clams are almost ready i'm now going to add this um, parsley just spread it around like that You can use coriander instead of parsley. You can use coriander and parsley, or you can skip the, the greens altogether. Um, per, personally, I like the freshness that they, they bring to, to the dish and uh, the contrast of the color, and it's vibrant. It's, it's a proper summer uh, treat. So here we have it. Um, I'm gonna be cheeky. This is, um, I'm not gonna uh, use the knife and fork to eat this. So typically you take a portion for yourself and then you just eat it off the shelf. Or off the shell, you just mm. Mm. how's it going? I'm just finishing my video here. <laughs> so, thank you very much for watching. Um, give me a thumbs up if you can, subscribe to the channel if you haven't, and I'll see you on the next one. Enjoy.